Hello, I'm uh, Dr. Matthias Mergé, Intensive Care Unit uh, Hospital Gale, Belgium. We made a setup for ventilating two or four patients uh, on one uh, ventilator. This is a setup for two patients. We can easily extrapolate it to four patients. This is the inspiratory limb divided into other inspiratory limbs, expiratory limbs with one way valves. We made a setup where you can adapt for compliance mismatch. On the inspiratory valve of each patient, ideally you would put a valve on each uh, inspiratory limb. You can do it also with one limb, but ideally you would place a valve on, on the two. This is a valve on the inspiratory limb where you can adjust the pressure and thus also the volume to the patient. This is just a standard valve you can buy at any plumbing or do-it-yourself shop. The diameters of our tubes are uh, 22 millimeters internal diameter and you can easily disconnect so it's plug and play. Just get some valves at uh, your local plumbing shop and uh, put them on your tubes. It's uh, so easy. If they don't fit really well, you can uh, make them fit with some, uh, some uh, Teflon tape. Uh, the blue tape you see here. You see the two test lungs. Now inflate um, on each breath, on each tidal volume. And you can easily adapt the um, the inflation of each lung. If you turn the valve on the inspiratory limb, you can compensate for each patient. If we see the test lungs, you see now that the left patient is less inflated than the right patient. So if this would be a very compliant patient and this um, very stiff, patient, very non-compliant patient, you would close the inspiratory valve to the compliant patient and thus he would not be overinflated. And so you can compensate. It's, um, it's a rough system, but I think um, this will do in uh, desperate times. Desperate times, but I think uh, not so a desperate measure. This is doable. Just buy some valves at the local uh, do-it-yourself shop, and uh, you are and uh, you can get started. Important: the one-way valves on the expiratory limb. I will explain again. Expiratory limb, inspiratory limb, standard T connectors uh, like this. I have one T connector here. Simple T connector and uh, it's all you need, some tubing T-connectors and a valve.